Um, so we've officially decided because that last video was like eight minutes and whatever. So we're going to do like, um, rants, um, on stuff that could be interesting. Annoy me. We're not going to do people because like it's a little touchy, like, oh, you I'll know. go there. I'll go there. No, <clears throat> we're not going to do people like Sarah Duel who block people and not block, but unfriend people people whatever okay whatever um we're just gonna do stuff like um like music certain clothes that bother me what about you i don't know like um i don't know what everybody's big deal is with those clogs crocs things oh my god they're so fucking they got holes in them they're fuzzy wouldn't really call them shoes but everyone's like oh my gosh they're so plastic let's buy them yeah, no my mom tried to get me a pair with a First thing around, I was like, that's the most ugliest thing in the world. I mean, world. Uggs are expensive. I tried on Chrissy's pair, super comfortable, but I don't, I would not spend like $200 on Uggs. That's what parents are supposed to buy them. My parents bought me a pair for $187, and they're beautiful, they're black. Yeah. Yeah. Other clothing that bothers me is like those, um, those, uh, big... Those big beaded necklace things that are like, beaded. they're like giant beads and they're plastic and they're fake and they're necklace with the, goes like big in the center and then it like small and. Really those? I don't, I don't like those. Yeah, I don't like those. I bought a pair for a friend actually. I bought a, I think I bought one from Megan Phelps for Christmas one. Yeah. I don't like those. I don't like, oh, sorry. I don't like a lot of things. I don't like the fact that, like, Abercrombie and Fitch, Aeropostale, their clothes, although they smell good, the perfume, cologne yeah, I like thing, the smell. smell good, but then they reek on your clothes, your, like, $50 shirt thing that you have to have, it reeks. I hate that the sizes are too small. The sizes are meant for stick people, and let's face it, there's not enough of them in this world to start a clothing store. Just saying. So, I don't know why everyone's trying to go in and fit into these tiny shirts, and it's not gonna happen. And, um, what else bothers me? Pet stores. Yeah, I could, I could go on forever about those. This is me practicing talking about stuff that I hate calmly. It's working out pretty well so far. <laughs> you almost bite your nail because you're uh, nervous. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um... I don't like pet stores because obviously they get them from puppy mills. They have stuff wrong with them. Yeah, they look adorable, but what happens when somebody doesn't buy them and they're not a puppy anymore? They kill, they them. kill them. So, you know what? Either you buy a messed up dog and it has some kind of illness or genetic disease with that it. That you don't know about. That you don't know about till you get it to t take it to the vet because it's sick or something and it dies. Or you don't buy it and then they kill it anyways. It's and the dogs there are so expensive. Now I just went there and every dog they is are one thousand dollars. Wicked expensive. They're it's, so cute though, but they all look so depressed. It's like that's horrible. And the reason they're sleeping in their cage is not because they're sleeping. It's because they're drugged up. It's like they just got here and they're still drugged up, so they're not naturally sleeping. And they're just their whole like cage thing. It's really unhealthy. Oh. Like you can't keep an animal in there for weeks. It's and also because it's not really healthy, because it's like they live there, but they're peeing and pooping there. And I think they're supposed to know they're not supposed to pee and poop where they live or something like that, right? Well, I don't have a dog, but... I just think the area which they live in is confined and unhealthy. Yeah, I understand. Uh, and what else don't I like? Italians. If you're Italian and you're watching this, I will fight you. <laughs> Because I'm Irish, and that's what we do. Oh, you're Irish? I thought you were Italian. Okay, I'm sorry. Hey, I, I don't even know what I am. Um, so I'm living up to my Irish stereotype where... No, I'm not going to drink because I'm just above that because I'm so cool. Um, but I will fight you. I have no problem fighting you. Unless you're ginormous. <laughs> I'll hire somebody else to fight you. <laughs> you got me, Bethan. Yeah. I'll give a mold one, too. 
Sorry, you had to see that. I'm sick. Um, I can't keep you away, though. <laughs> <laughs> Sicko. Yeah, uh, nope. What else do you hate? I don't know. I just hate the... I, like I said in the other video, I hate people that are stuck up. And, like, think that they're Besides really cool. people. People are controversial. <sighs> okay, um... I don't know. What do I hate? Oh, I, I hate... I don't know. I don't know what I hate. Oh, my God. I don't like the fact that old people's homes smell like disgusting Dying. death. It's like they want to keep you away. Like, that's just the aroma itself is so disgusting. It's like, oh, fuck. You know you, walk, you know you walked into an old person's home when it's like, ugh, old people. Like, try cleaning Snow it. Gold. Maybe people would visit you some more. Um, <laughs> that's, that's not nice because, you know, everybody's going to end up there. So, I would just wear a lot of perfume or something. Or maybe not look old. No, I old people look fine. They just smell disgusting. Why is that? They're old. They're you just give ancient. off some disgusting, pungent odor when you get older. Yeah. It's like, old person, beware. <laughs> I would work there if I didn't have to, like, change bedpans and... Diapers. <clears throat> Like, old kids. people are nice, because they have lots of stories to tell, but... And lots of money. They, no, some of them are poor. That's why they live there. Oh. If they were rich, they'd I'm have somebody take dad. care of them at their house. I'm putting my dad in a home as soon as possible. <laughs> I know. I'm, like, telling my parents. I'm, like, you're not living with me. You're going to an old people's home. My dad says I'm going to take care of him when I'm older. That's what my mom says, too, but she seriously is lacking in brain power. She thinks I'm going to take care of her. Um... So, come on, we can keep this going. Yes, we We're can. We're having like our own talk show. Yeah. Besides things that I hate, things that I like: puppies, unicorns, rainbows, pink stuff. Just kidding. I like puppies, but the, the other stuff I said is not true. Um, Sparkles. I don't like unicorns because they're ugly. True story. I know. I did just say that. Apparently, true story thing. Everybody's been saying that? No. I was saying that before everybody was like, true story. I was like, what are you talking about? I just said true story. They're like, yeah, everybody's been saying it. I was like, what are you talking about? I said true story. I'd be like, tell a story. I'm like, yeah, true story. He's like, no. Me. I love you. I'm so mad. All right, I gotta save battery. It's like halfway done, so I'm closing the little flappy thing. Okay. Um, so, true story. Mine. Um, me. If I said it, would you, like, kill me? No, because you're my, like, biffle. <laughs> um, let's see. I need to talk about something. I feel so, like, I don't know. Uh, um. Are you going to get another pet? I had, I was in tears about this. Oh, my God. My mom was like, no more pets. I'm like, how come I can't get a new rabbit? She's like, you don't need one. And my dog just walked in. She can open the door by herself. Isn't that creepy? Yeah. Hey, Ellie, come. Come oh, up here. She's going to mess oh. up the shot. Oh, she's not going to. Oh, jeez, she's sitting on my foot. Oh, yeah, who's a good girl? Mwah. Ugh. But, yeah, and I asked her because I fell in love with this ferret. And what did she say? Um, She looked at it and went, ew, and ran out of the pet store. Mm. And I cried and I left and I asked whenever I can get a new pet she's like never and so I've decided once I'm 18 I'm buying a ferret and I'm putting it in her bed just to make her feel better wow yeah I'm gonna... <sighs> all right this one's even longer than the other one I, I gotta stop now 